So the power of Apple's ecosystem is without a doubt uncomparable. And I recently showed this in one of my latest videos that got viral, I think, as the moment we speak right now, we just crossed 5 million views and many of you were asking how I did this, how I used my Mac and my iPhone at the same time to make an amazing signature that you can use on all your PDF documents. And I'm gonna stop gatekeeping this. Let's dive into the tutorial and let me show you exactly how you can do this as well. Okay, so let me share exactly with you the steps needed in order to do this yourself. So obviously we need an iPhone and we need a Apple Pencil, but more about this pencil later. We need to open the previews app first. So let's go on command spacebar to open the spotlight or I have Alfred installed. That's a bit more powerful than spotlight. And we hit preview. There we go. We open the app just like that. You get the download screen. You can just cancel this because that's not important right now. We need to go to the top left, to the top bar with the options and we go to tools. And in tools, we go to annotate and we go all the way to the bottom to signature. If you haven't already made any signatures, this is completely empty. If you have, you have a bunch of signatures. You go all the way to manage signatures. We click on that and then we create a new signature, click on create signature. And here we have three options. We have the trackpad possibility to make a signature. We can use the camera, which will use the camera on your MacBook. And then you need a piece of paper and put that in front. But that's not the option that I'm going to demonstrate here. And lastly, this is the one we're interested in. It's the iPhone or iPad one. Let's click on iPhone and then we need to select a device. I'm already taking my iPhone 16 Pro Max here. We select a device and as you can see here, iPhone 16 Pro, that's how this is called. If we click on that, it's automatically going to open it just like that. It recognizes it and now the fun part starts so yes you can do this basically with your finger and just draw your signature just like that as you can see it's automatically recognized on mac but what we can also do is use a pencil so this is actually not an apple pencil i'll put a link in the description below for you to find it as well i just found this on amazon and i actually had to buy two or three of them in order to find one that was supporting touch display for the iPhone. Like a lot of the styluses that you find online are not compatible on iOS or iPhone. And I found this one and this works. So let me just show you what happens when you just use a normal Apple Pencil. So we are here have just the normal Apple Pencil. Go and take my iPhone and as you can see, nothing happens at all. This is normal. The Apple Pencil is compatible with iPad only, but this device, this stylus here, if we double tap it on top, you can see it turns on and now we can actually use it to make our signature just like that i mean how awesome is this using just your iphone and then third-party stylus basically to draw your signature on mac i mean this is the power of the ecosystem but let's say you don't have your iphone with you or you don't have the pencil that i just showed you can always use your ipad so it's a pretty similar process what we need to do here we go to iphone or ipad then we click on select device and we select our ipad just like that ipad from niels and yeah it's basically the same process but now you can use your apple pencil grab my apple pencil from on my iPad just like that there it is and then you can just use your Apple Pencil and make your signature right here on this device and just like that it's going to be recognized on Mac if you're happy with your signature just hit done and there it is added on the top and ready to be used in any PDF. So let me quickly show you how that looks. So I just have this template, this simple contract, just an example to give you an idea how you can quickly add your self-made signature. Again, we go to tools, go to annotate, and then we go all the way to the signature one. And here you can just select any signature. So let's select the one we just created, just like that. It's gonna be added to the document and you can just put it wherever you like and make it bigger and smaller and adjust it accordingly. Easy as that. So you can quickly sign any PDF, any document on Mac using your iPhone, using your iPad. If this was helpful, make sure to hit the bell icon, subscribe so you don't miss any of my other videos. And obviously if you enjoyed this and this was helpful, give me a like, that would mean a lot. See you in the next one and peace.